Reprising her role on this very piano is Darcy Miller at Good Samaritan Society de Smit in South Dakota. When my dad was the administrator here, he's the one that did devotions every day. When the registered nurse was younger, my dad asked me to play the piano. Her musical talents sometimes accompanied dad's devotions in this chapel. A lot of kids are afraid of nursing homes. We were brought up around old people. The room strikes a chord for a number of reasons. Makes me want to cry. I don't like change. <laughs> so then when you were here, this was just an extension of rooms, right? Yeah. Okay. For 30 years, it's been a blessing to have a, a, a great job that you love. Retired for 20. Old home week. 84 year old Jerry Keller. Good to be back. Oh yes, definitely. I miss the place. Still has it. I used to run this place years ago. The residents were very important to me. I wanted to make sure they got the best of care. <laughs> I was really fortunate that I had great staff. When he was here, I mean, if they needed help in the kitchen, he had a hairnet on. If there was something that needed to be cleaned up on the floor, he was on his hands and knees. Being the hands and feet of Jesus here in DeSmit is a family tradition, even during a pandemic. A few years ago, I just decided it was time to come back to my roots and work for Good Sam again. What sets Good Sam apart from any other place is that it was founded on Christian principles. It continues today like that. We are called to take care of our neighbors, to be the Good Samaritan. That's what we do. The mission has been a big part of my life, and take care for people. Residents, workers, they just care for people. Promising to be happily retired, Jerry's passion for those people still brings on a flood of emotion. Well, I guess because I'm not in it now, and I probably would like to be, like to be back in it. But I'm getting too old for that. <laughs> My dad left a legacy. So it's up to me to take care of the people. Sorry. The society is also looking back on its 100 year legacy. I was like, oh, 100 years? Wow. <laughs> I didn't know Good Sam was celebrating that milestone. And I just got to thinking, well, what kind of story would I share? Well, the chapel is just part of my story. Yesterday, I celebrated my 25th wedding anniversary and I got married in the chapel. The chapel is my place. <laughs> With family members living at the nursing home at the time and dad at the helm, it was a perfect pick. It made sense <laughs> to have the wedding here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so he stood right here 25 years ago yesterday. Things change and we grow. But it feels good. It feels good, good to, to worship again. and praise God and just be here. I'm glad I was a part of it. And uh, probably still would be if I was a little younger. Dad even used to have a little piece of paper in his car that was a quote from August Hager. And it said, Lord, what will you have me do today? And that's what I think, too. With the Good Samaritan Society and Sanford Health News, I'm Matt Holson.